Hey guys, it's Embassoon. How y'all doing? As you can see in front of me right now, I have the new iPod Nano 5th generation. Uh, so I just got back from the Apple store. It uh, cost me a couple hundred dollars. But before I actually go into unboxing itself, I want to actually talk about something that I got this week. Uh, I actually got a new camera, which is actually uh, shoots high definition video. Uh, which is actually a bonus for you guys because now you can watch all my videos in high definition uh, that I take with this camera. It's a little bit of an upgrade from my last uh, camera. Uh, if you're wondering what camera it is and you're actually interested in it, it is a Canon uh, PowerShot 940IS. So if you're interested in this, it's $300 from Best Buy. Uh, it's not a bad deal. Uh, got it on sale for uh, $300. It's usually $350. So if you want uh, find more information about just go search it up. So, okay, guys, so now I'm going to be uh, doing the unboxing itself. As you can see right here, I have the iPod Nano 5th generation. Uh, I told you about a month ago I was going to get this. Uh, as you know, it has an add on uh, from the previous one, the 4th generation. Of course, it has a larger screen and it also has a built in camera, which is uh, something that was quite surprising to me and probably to you guys. So let's get this unboxing started. So I haven't opened it yet, but I did uh, actually uh, take this off, uh, the top part from right here, just to make it a little bit easier when opening. Uh, this is not being opened yet, guys. I just open this. There we go, guys. Okay, so as you can see, uh, it comes off quite simple. Uh, there you go, a shiny new iPod Nano 5th generation. Uh, I did get a purple colored. Uh, that was a, like, they only had two different colors, purple and pink. Uh, I bought this at... Uh, uh, this is all they had in stock, so I bought it at the Apple store. Uh, it's 8 uh, gigabytes, if I didn't uh, tell you guys yet. Uh, but this was my favorite color out of the two, because obviously I'm not going to get a pink. Uh, so let me find how I can get this. There we go, guys. Okay, so I'll be going to this in a sec. Let's see what's in here. Okay, so as you can see, it says designed by Apple in California. So all their iPods are... Uh, May, uh, designed in Apple but manufactured in China. So as you can see it says start here and then Demirage. Uh, that's uh, French right there. So assuming that this is an instruction manual. Uh, so there you go. You you always get this for any Apple product you buy. Uh, two Apple logos. Uh, maybe I can put that on my laptop a little bit later on. So uh, important product information right here. Uh, not too much. Maybe a little bit of uh, information about where it was made, uh, uh, phone numbers, uh, email addresses, I don't know, maybe safety and concerns, but that over there. Uh, this is maybe instruction manual, maybe how to use the iPod itself. Yes, it is, guys. Uh, as you can see, it has FM radio, uh, just standard. It comes with any iPod or any uh, Apple product. Uh, as you can see, uh, this is actually for... Um, a music dock. I have a music dock. Uh, I actually have an iHome, so I'll be using that to play music with. Uh, of course, the headphones here. Uh, nothing special about the headphones itself. Uh, same headphones as uh, any other iPod Nano or iPod. Uh, nothing new there. Uh, as you can see here, uh, it is still the same uh, USB cord uh, to plug it into a computer. The only difference that I can kind of see right now is that uh, uh, the part that actually plugs into the iPod itself is smaller. So that's actually, I think, I don't know if that's an add-on. I think that happened with the iPod Touch second generation, but I'm not 100% sure, guys. Okay, so there we go. That part's done. Okay, so let me just tell you a little bit about the box. So iPod Nano with the Apple logo. On the back, it tells you a little bit of information where it's made. Uh, uh, where it's manufactured, what's included, uh, and that's about it for uh, the add-ons. And now the product itself, guys. So as you can see right here, um, there's a little bit of information about how to take the iPod off. Uh, so it's time you just bend it forward, and there we go, guys. Okay, so I'll put that to the side with there over there. Okay, so there's the iPod itself right there. Okay, let me bring this up to the screen. Uh, it kind of looks a little bit bluish, but don't be fooled, guys. This is a purple iPod Nano 5th generation. So, uh, right away, uh, I can see some differences between the iPod Nano 5th generation and 4th generation. I can see this is much slimmer, uh, uh, and, uh, it's much, uh, has, like, more of a metallic, uh, 
a paint job. It's more of a it has more of a shine to it than the iPod Nano 4th generation. It was more dull. Uh, as you can see, the camera is an add-on right there. Uh, some more information about it. Uh, designed by Apple in California. Uh, all the serial numbers, assembled in China, model number, uh, not to throw in the garbage, and just some little bit more information. Uh, standard on all Apple uh, iPods. Uh, the Apple sign logo and the iPod right there. Uh, so as you can see, I don't know if any of you have the fourth generation, but the screen is maybe I don't know a couple inches uh, bigger in height, and I'd say about the same in width. But I could be wrong. Let's see if this turns on. And just make sure. Okay, guys, as you can see, uh, the startup menu it has just uh, immediately started. So I want English U.S. right there. So as you can see, uh, music, uh, cover flow, all that, videos, uh, photos. But let's uh, scroll down to my favorite, which is the newest part of this, is a video camera. So as you can see, guys, the video camera does work. Uh, let me show you. So it does work, guys. Uh, it's actually quite magnificent. So I'll just bring this up and show you through the screen. As you can see, I don't know, it's, pro it's definitely not a better feature than uh, the iPod and, uh, as the camera itself, but it is actually a little bit of a feature. As you can see on the corner up here, uh, so right there it is a little recording sign, and there is uh, something that tells you how many minutes, how many seconds, and how many hours that you've used uh, within the iPod Nano 5th generation. Uh, so uh, 8 gigabytes. Uh, iPod Nano 5th generation, uh, not much to say, a review coming up in maybe a month or so, month, two months, uh, tell you how I like it, I'll tell you if it scratches easily, uh, but I don't know, I'll be the judge of that for now, uh, but for now I think I'll be going and plugging into my computer with my USB code cord and uh, playing some music and downloading some music into it uh, from the uh, iTunes store. Uh, so guys, uh, this has been my unboxing of the iPod Nano 5th generation. Uh, it's actually an amazing product, beautiful, uh, beautiful color, beautiful design, uh, so slim and so light. Okay guys, so it is a purple iPod Nano 5th generation and you'll be expecting a view in a month or two months. Okay guys, so you know the drill on all my other videos. Uh, as you can see, uh, uh, comment, rate, and subscribe. I don't know if any of you saw uh, my video. I actually removed it uh, now. But if you want to still be in the collab video uh, where all the reviewers are coming together, just uh, PM me and I'll send you some more information. We're be going to be reviewing the PSP Go. But now since I got this today, I don't know. We might be doing this. I'm not 100% sure. Uh, so comment, rate, and subscribe, guys, and talk to you guys later.